Hello friends, welcome again to another session on problem solving and proving theorems. So in this theorem, it's given that there are three or more parallel lines and they are intersected by two transversals. We have to prove that intercepts made by them on the transversals are proportional. Okay, so I have shown it in a diagram. So P and Q and R are parallel to each other. So let's write given first. So given, what is given? P is to, P is parallel to Q is parallel to R. Three lines are parallel to each other. Okay, now L and M, L and M, small m, are transversals. Transversals, right? Now, uh, what is to be pro proven? So to prove, we need to prove that AB by BC is equal to DE by EF. This is also called intercept theorem, right? So any, uh, I have shown only three lines, but you can go for four lines, five parallel lines and all that. So the intercept, so what is an intercept? Intercept is nothing but this is called an intercept. So this is an intercept. This is also an intercept. So these are all intercepts. So these intercepts are proportional. That's what we need to prove okay so let us do some construction so again if there are ratios involved you know the best tool in our uh, quiver is the basic proportionality theorem so let's try and prove that using the basic proportionality theorem only okay so how to go about it so you know that in basic proportionality theorem you need to have a triangle and there must be a line parallel to the base and then you can write the ratios equal, right? So here you can see ratios are there, lines are parallel. We have to achieve some ratios inequality. So hence, we need to first find out a triangle, yeah, appropriate triangle to establish or to apply BPT. So what I'm going to do is, I am going to do a construction where I am going to draw a line like this, which is parallel to M passing through like that so what is the construction construction is uh, let's call it lmn right so let's call this line as n so n parallel to m drawn right and it is intersecting the pqr at n uh, points a and let's say uh, g and h okay g and h now what can we what can we say clearly now you can see a triangle a c h appearing isn't it so in triangle in triangle a c h what can we say we can say since b g is parallel to c h b g is parallel to c h therefore what can be very easily said a b upon b c is equal to a g upon G H and this is because of DPT basic proportionality theorem right now somehow if I prove that A G by G H is equal to D by E F then my game is over isn't it that's what we need to prove so A G by G H somehow is equal to D by E F which is indeed so why because if you look carefully what's here if you see N is parallel to N is parallel to M as well as M uh, P is parallel to Q. Therefore, what can we conclude? We can conclude that A D E G is a parallelogram. Is a parallelogram. I hope there is no doubt in this. Correct. So A B A D E G is a parallelogram. Therefore, opposite sides of a parallelogram being equal, I can write A G is equal to D E. I hope by now you would have guessed the rest of the proof, isn't it? Similarly, write the word similarly. Right. P again L is oh sorry N is parallel to M. N is parallel to M and Q is parallel to R. Therefore. Again, you can say G E F H is a parallelogram. Again, same logic, opposite sides are equal. So hence, the quadrilateral becomes a parallelogram. Therefore, you can conclude G H is equal to E F. 
right now look at this particular theorem or this part which you need to prove now if you see a g by g h can be written as what is a g guys d e so write d e and g h is equal to e f so write e f so a g by g h is d e by e f so let it be 1 and let it be 2 so in 1 and 2 in 1 and 2 from 1 and 2 rather from 1 and 2 what could you conclude you can conclude that a b by b c is equal to a uh, d e by e f that is what we intended to prove now you would say this is true only for true lines no this is true for any number of parallel lines you can see let's say if there are lines like these one two three four so you can you know let's say these are the intercepts so you can very easily say this by this is equal to this by this similarly this by this will be equal to this by that like that right so hence in that chain if you go you can prove that this by this by this will be equal to this by this by that right so one by one you have to prove so this by this is equal to this by this by the earlier pro proven theorem and again this by this will be equal to this by this so like that the chain will continue so you can see that all the intercepts will be proportional so it can be validated or it can be established for more more than three parallel lines as well okay so here was the proof of this particular theorem which is also called intercept theorem